Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have my Boxy Charm. I'm going to show you what I got. I've actually used the products, so I will give you my reviews and like swatches and things like that. Um, unlike most people who do unboxings, I usually wait a week at least um, just to try out the products. That's my dog. You like your toy? <laughs> Uh, just to try them out. I feel like it's a little bit more helpful for you guys if you're gonna sign up for something It's like oh, okay those seem like really great products, but were they crap or were they good? So let's go ahead and get started. We do get this um, Card in each box and it just uh, describes the theme and then all the products and lists the prices and if it's a full-size or a deluxe size boxycharm, I believe is like $21.95 a month. I'll put it on the screen if I'm wrong I always forget guys I'm so sorry the thing is I get a planner uh, subscription service and they're like a dollar off of each other so I always forget but this month's theme was C'est la vie like C S E A so it's like a C beachy kind of theme it's a really pretty card and I believe I added everything up and it actually adds up to like 120 122 dollars or something like that and so let's go ahead and get started we also get this little card and there is a sale enjoy $20 off of your order at $50 or more off of mailbeads.com the promo code is a boxy charm so if you guys want to use that i won't be using it so knock yourself out i feel like that's a generic code now quick peek where all these products it's not looking pretty because like i said i've opened this i've used it but let's start with what's on my nails because i actually use this nail polish um i haven't received the ncla nail polish before actually i think I think I did. I think I did receive one and I wasn't really impressed with it. It was a pretty color, but it's supposed to be, let me just show you, I got color volume four and this is the box that it comes in and that's obviously the color and it's just like a really nice neutral and nude. And let me see, guys, my neighbors are always working on their house. So obviously this is a full size. These are $16. Um, it's a sandy nude hue to attract all attention you need on and offshore. So it's supposed to apply in one to two coats and you finish off with a top coat. And I do remember the other one that I have, it chipped very easily and it took a long time to dry, but I feel like it was just streaky. So like I had to apply a lot of thin coats and then it was just, I don't know, maybe that's why because there were so many coats. But this, some nails were perfectly opaque in one kind of you know just one coat and some nails I, I did two on all of them just to be sure but it's a really pretty color I like it this is very work appropriate this is very mommy friendly this is very I have short short stubby fingers or nails and I don't want to draw attention but I want like a pretty color I feel like this kind of color is just like kind of sexy too because it's nude it's like wearing nude heels you know so I really do like this um really nice finish guys I painted my nails and I was watching tv with my husband my arm was around him because he's my boo and he like looked off and he's like your thumb is really shiny and I'm like that's actually not how he talks that's just how I imitate him and I'm like uh thanks what about the rest of my nails <laughs> like is it just one nail but I'm um, just one nail but yeah, so this is the NCLA Nudes. I really do like this. I can't really justify spending $16 on a nail polish. I've done it, but I just have so much nail polish now. I'm like, absolutely not. Uh, the next thing we got was this cute little kabuki brush. It's from Bella Pierre Cosmetics, which we've gotten before. Bella Pierre's in like a lot of different um, subscription services. And this is a full size. It's $29.99. I wouldn't spend this much money on any kabuki brush. Like it doesn't matter if it was laced with crack. I was going to say gold, but crack is just funnier, right? So this is the best-selling kabuki brush for them. It's cruelty-free. It's made um, of 100% synthetic fibers, which is really good because it doesn't absorb the product, and it's just supposed to really disperse the powder or whatever you're doing, really blend everything. It is really soft. It's nice. It's really nice. I have small kabuki brushes like this. It, it is shedding a little. Um, my dog is, like, knocking over my little stool here that has all my stuff. But... It's nicer than the cheap ones I have, but Mama is not spending $29.99 on a little kabuki brush. On any brush, let's be real. Come on. Um, but it is nice, so I'm glad to have it. Um, okay, okay, okay. What next? Okay, so we'll talk about this highlight. This is a this is from the beauty crop. It's the light, the lighting crew nourished with pineapple and green tea. And it's a highlighting cream. And this guy is $16. All of my products here are full size, which is really cute. And it has pineapples, which I love. Pineapples are like 
this huge craze right now and I'm loving it because I've always loved pineapples. I love the fruit. My last name is Pina. Everyone says Pina or Benya, but it's Pina. My husband's father's side is Cape Verdean. Um, so it's Pina, but it is their little family insignia is the pineapple and I just love it because I'm stocking up on everything. But so this, like I said, is $16 full size, which is a lot for this little guy. Just saying. Oh my God, look how cute. It says, love you so much. -a. Like, I love you so much. -a. Like if you're Italian, only not. This highlighting cream will accentuate and highlight your best features. It nourishes and brightens your skin. Uh, you could add it on top of your cheekbones, your brow bone, your inner corner of your eyes. You can use it under your foundation or mix it with your body lotion for an all over glow. Now what I did was actually use my e.l.f. small stipple brush, put some on the tip and just tapped it right here and here. It was beautiful. It is very difficult to blend. Like, it was very difficult to blend. I think I just waited too long from applying my primer and my BB cream and then my blush and all this other stuff. Like, I think I just needed to do everything faster. Um, I have mixed this into my lotion, just kind of like on my decollete. Beautiful. Maybe I should actually show you guys what it looks like, right? Now, I opened it. It's just a little squeezy tube and it went everywhere. So I actually had to throw it in like this little uh, lush sample thing that I have. Like, look how much came out. It's really, really pretty. Oh, it's just gorgeous. Look, oh my God, see? See what I mean, guys? It's beautiful. I don't even need to like, so if you just dab that in your finger, like right on your inner corner, let me, oh, see? I'm a nutcase, right? It's, it really is stunning. But see, if you leave it for just long enough, oh, you guys can't see, it's hard to blend. So it became less obvious, you know, like it blended a little bit, but it's very, I could see the, the edges of that swatch very easily. I think you guys can see a little bit there. So beautiful, beautiful, beautiful highlight. Um, work quickly. We'll just say that. And it's not something I would buy. Let's be honest. I don't know the brand. And if someone was like, oh, here's a beautiful, gorgeous highlight. It's the most amazing thing. It's $16. I'd be like, uh, I'll give you four bucks. So, <laughs> you know. It's just the way it is. And I think the packaging has something to do with that. Uh, we also got a lipstick. And I was really excited for this. I saw a few people get this lipstick. And this is the Duce, Duce, I don't know. Click Click Lipstick. It's a full size. It's $24. This is upside down, right? Yeah. This is what it looks like. And... It's the perfect blend of beauty, color, and fashion with a sheer and smooth, lightweight, non-sticky formula. It's infused with soothing and protective ingredients that leave your lips feeling good all day. Now, like I said, it's $24. I love the packaging, guys. It is so cool. So it's just a bullet, right? You push the bottom in, and then it pops out. How cute, right? Now, if only I loved it. <laughs> because this is the color. I have it in 813. Yeah, that's great. It is just a number, right? Yeah. Now, it is a sheer color. You can see it's not like, it's not definitely an opaque pigmented, pigmented color. I saw other people get this and I was like, oh, I really want it because I thought it would be like a nude. This is like a frosty, mauve cool toned pink with some nude thrown in it's not ugly by any means but i threw this in my bag and it's all i had to wear to work and i'm like oh my god i need a dark lip liner i need something because it just looks <sighs> okay can you see guys can you see comment down below and let me know i'm just so disappointed it didn't leave my lips feeling good all day it also didn't leave my lips looking good all day and it also didn't last all day i also hate the smell it's very chemically that probably was the ugliest face i'm sorry guys um okay now the last thing i was really excited about because you guys know i love me some skincare this is eslor chlorophyll lifting mask really pretty packaging it's just like this bronzy coppery kind of color this is 38 dollars. it's a full size it is natural milk proteins plant extracts seaweed extracts minerals that tighten the skin it helps enhance blood circulation and diminish fine lines and your skin should instantly appear luminous and noticeably firmer you're supposed to use it twice a week and you just wash your face and then just apply a thin layer and then once it dries which for me it takes about like five to seven minutes tops for it to dry you just you can see it like moves around 
you just uh, wash it off. Now the thing is when it dries, it is like a, it looks like peeling skin. So you're like, why can't I just peel this off? But it says to wash it off, so I wash it off. Now, I really like the smell of this. It smells like a mask. Like it smells like a gel, what a gel mask should smell like. Like it smells like it works, <laughs> you know? It's, I don't know, I like it. I've only used it twice. It says to use it twice in a week. I'll probably use it more than that in a week. I'll probably be done with this pretty quickly. But um, but it it's nice. It goes on and almost looks like aloe vera. I guess I can just, okay, so you can see. See how like tacky it is? It's like Slimer from, um, what is it, Ghostbusters? And I'm just wiping this off on my hand. So I've used it twice and it's nice. It says you should like right away see like what, a tightening in your skin, yeah, noticeably firmer, your skin appears luminous. Um, I don't know, I, I don't know. I definitely didn't see that. My skin felt nice. I, anytime I use anything on my skin, like any kind of mask right after, I feel like my skin always looks and feels nice. Why wouldn't it, right? At least right after it should. If guys, if you're putting stuff on your face and you don't see any kind of difference, like right after, like mask wise, uh, maybe that thing isn't working. So this box retails for one hundred and twenty-three dollars and ninety-nine cents. That's pretty great, guys. I think it's like twenty-one bucks. Like, come on. Um, now, if you have a bunch of subscription services, just think about what you're getting because if you're getting like one product from each one that you like, you're actually wasting money, to be honest. But I'm. How do I feel about this box? For 21 bucks, do I like what I got? But I'm really happy with it, because even if I take away this lipstick, which is only, what, was this 16 or 24? This was $24. So then, even without that, this box is still worth 100 bucks. So I'm happy with it. So I just wanted to show you guys what I got, what I thought of these products. Let me know if you get this, what you got. I know sometimes the colors differ, Hopefully, if you got it, you got a better lipstick, or maybe it looks better on your skin tone. Um, or if you get other things. I miss my Ipsy. I don't regret canceling it, but my heart hurts a little bit every time my sister-in-law tells me what she got. <sighs> but that's it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I will leave the link uh, to BoxyCharm in the information bar down below. Comment, like, thumbs up, subscribe, all that good stuff. I will see you guys in the next video. Stay beautiful and stay blessed. Bye.